Well, I seen on Instagram the homie posted that they robbed our rail. Like, what? What do you mean the rail? Our flat bar. Hey, let me find out. It was you? Nah, I'm just playing. Ah, uh, dude, that Who thing that does not. Who took the rail? I don't know. Well, they find out it was your homie. Oh my gosh. What is this? I don't know I can't. Bro! Y'all have one mission! Save the skate park! At least I brought our different rail. Dude, that thing's ghetto! You know that thing's gonna get stolen right away. Well that's why we're gonna take it back. Who took it? We don't know. I pulled up and it was gone. Oh my gosh. It was so bad. How is this going to affect us? I can't. I don't know. That's why I brought this one because I don't know how long it's going to take for the park people to come back. So. Dude, I could bring a beautiful, beautiful rail, but I would never bring it because it gets stolen. Exactly why I'm not going to leave it here. You're just bringing it when you're here? Yeah, I just brought it like a little bit ago. When I heard the flat bar was gone, I had to go to the skate park immediately. It hurt my heart, honestly, because out of the 11 years of that skate park being there not once did i think that that rail would be gone or that it would be stolen um with that flat bar i was able to learn and better myself at skating rails like i owe it to this flat bar to the type of skater that i am and the type of skating i like because without it i literally probably wouldn't be skating handrails or i wouldn't be doing the the 270 lips or flip outs that I do now, I spent so much time on that. And I even filmed so many trick tips on rails because I felt the need that people needed to understand how simple it kind of was to skate rails versus skating like down stuff. It's a bummer to see it gone. And I really do hope that we get a new flat bar. And to the person that stole it, you're lame because this literally was motivating and building the confidence of the younger generation. So if you have a flat bar, just know the value of it because it really does wonders having something like that. And RIP to our flat bar because it was one of the best. I would like to know how beneficial having a flat bar is to you. Does it help you learn? Do, if your flat bar was stolen, would you feel the same way I felt? I, I'm curious to know because I'm genuinely bummed out that I can't just warm up with a back 50 grind real quick once I enter the skate park. Let me know what y'all think. Bro, they stole our flat bar. That's funny, bro. <laughs> That's fucked up. <laughs> they put a box in front of where the rail would be. Like the mm. plastic box, they moved it. Uh, no pickles? No. Nah. You know why? Why? You already know. Oh, from Spongebob? The guy puts it under his tongue? Nah, bro, because they, they're like shaped like a dick. <laughs> okay, <laughs> imagine. The new borderline gear. So oh. we got these uh, Nike shoes. Um, $19? Here you go, happy birthday, bro. I don't wear Nikes, I'm chilling. Oh, it's all good, dude. Just wait for that borderline Nike flap. Ah. Just sit out. <laughs> I will sit out. I'll wait for the Adidas borderline. Oh shit, it feels like Christmas, bro. Okay, this one's yours. Oh, you finally got us a check. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about, bro. A check. <laughs> you see, borderline up here. Get there now before it starts becoming like Supreme prizes. Hey, low key, I'm gonna have to up charge in one day. I ordered beanies, I fucking remember paying for it, and it's almost like. That shit like never happened on some like Mandela effect. I thought that was an actual collab with Ninja. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that would have been crazy. I mean, I could expect it, that's why. Oh. Fly like a. Da, 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 sting like a bee, fly like a butterfly. Hey yo, I, I got you a gift. Yeah? Yeah. What? I already got a girlfriend, dude. Oh, all right, I'll just give it a mugly then. Yeah, yeah. Hey. Oh! No, no, you have to do it. Because in J in Japan, in Japan, it's a tradition for guys to give it to. So you're saying he's a girl. <laughs> well, he's wearing pink. <laughs> I'm kidding. Oh. Oh, you don't understand, dude. This. Oh. <laughs>
<laughs> oh, dude, my, my, my knee, my knee. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, fuck the, He's like, fuck the shirts. I got the peanut butter bites, homie. Shit, yeah, dude, this shit's fire, dude. I, you, if you haven't tried this, you have to try it. This what is it? GFB? What is that? Gluten free bites, bro. He got me on this thing, but like, I remember when I saw it at the store. I was like, damn, people are reselling this thing for like 30 bucks. No! Yeah, it's crazy, bro. What, there's like nine bucks a pop? I don't know, I so, got mine at like TJ Maxx or something for like four bucks. I remember I got it in Vegas for like seven or something. It's like, dude, they're like, I thought they're like eight, eight bucks. They're like nine. eight bucks at CVS and like <laughs> Vegas it's like 10 or like seven. I, don't even, I know you like titties, so. <laughs> Especially big ones. So there you go, Might have to blur some of this shit out, but <laughs> Bro, I don't know if you remember, but back you in the probably put this one in. <laughs> back in the day when we were in Japan, Ipe was going in some magazines. What the fuck are you talking about? Oh I You guys wanna see something cool? It says Kora Achan S1 Nanda Kara Omoikiri. What does that mean? Dude, dude, from the shot, man. What does that mean? She said, ah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> After we got done warming up at the skate park, uh, Ivan, Ipe, and I went to a spot. I got a clip for my video part that should be dropping on the 19th or the 22nd of this month, which is February. It's for the borderline drop that's dropping on the same day that the video part's dropping. It's gonna be dope, I'm excited. Uh, I wasn't able to film as much as I'd wanted to because uh, earlier in January, I fell on my knee and like it literally has lasted till now. I'm feeling way better now. I'm able to skate like way more, but I'm excited for the part. It's been a while since I dropped some street clips. So if you wanna know when the video part drops exactly, follow Borderline and stay tuned because I'm excited for y'all to see some of the stuff that we got. I'm like really hyped. So thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, and sign out until next time.